Welcome back to Spoiler Free Wrestling, everyone. And Chris Jericho recently sat down and took part in an interview with Forbes. And during the course of the interview, Jericho said that the All Elite Wrestling TV deals that he's heard about would be game changers for the industry. Now, this is the big question surrounding this promotion that is as of yet unanswered is... When are they going to announce a TV deal? What type of TV deal will they have? What network are they going to be on? Is the show going to be live? Will it be two hours? Will it be one hour? Will it be three hours? We don't have any of those answers right now. It does sound as though those answers will be revealed in the coming months. Now, here's what Jericho told Forbes about a potential all-elite wrestling television deal. He said... I'm not going to show up somewhere that doesn't have a major league television deal. That's not what I'm interested in doing. I'm not doing this to be a martyr or Robin Hood. I'm doing this to continue to grow my brand and to take over the business and the world. And then he continued to talk about possible TV deals. He goes, I know a few potential suitors for television. I know some potential ideas as far as how we're going to do. I know that both of them that I've heard are game changers. So, I mean, where is All Elite Wrestling going to end up when they announce a TV deal? We know one's coming. We know one. We know a TV deal is in the works based on comments made by everyone involved with All Elite Wrestling. And they're certainly building it up as it'll be a big deal. So we'll have to see. Jericho also talked about All Elite Wrestling's roster. And... Jericho said, I think we've assembled a great roster already of fresh talent. We have the seasoned veterans and really untapped rookies with great people on every level. We have six to eight blue chippers. That's all you need to do a wrestling company. I think we have enough talent for the first year already. He would continue to talk about AEW's impact on the industry already. He said, I think what AEW has done is shaken up the big companies. And when I say that, I mean WWE and New Japan, to where they're signing everybody and signing them to longer deals and more money. And I say to all of them, you're welcome. Jericho continued, we have to work and build the roster that we already have, knowing that we'll get more. But for right now, we have to assume this is our roster. For next year, let's build some guys and create some of our own stars, which is mandatory for any wrestling company to have. And then the topic of a potential AEW video game came up, and this will have some fans really excited. Here's what Jericho had to say about that. I would see no reason not to. I'd say it's pretty much inevitable at this point. Not only do you have this whole group of guys who aren't in any other video game, but you also have huge video game fans within this group with Kenny Omega, Cody, and the Bucks. I actually don't think the Bucks are video game fans, but Kenny Omega is a big one. Um, So could we see? Could we see an all elite wrestling video game in the coming years? WCW and WWE used to fight over who would get the video game rights. There's no doubt another video game company that would love to license a wrestling game. But we'll keep you up to date with everything going on with All Elite Wrestling. Just make sure you hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any news or reports from Spoiler Free Wrestling.